Hello everyone, my name is Hexyuko and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be doing another horror manga. You know how much I enjoyed the last one. This one is called The Ghost of Ma Sung Tunnel. This one's made, I think, by the same person who made the last one, which was the Oxu Station, which is pretty cool. So I'm very excited for this one. Let's get right into it. The Ghost of Ma Sung Tunnel. Written and illustrated by Horang. Hopefully I'm saying it right. All right, let's begin. It was several years ago. All right, we're riding a train, we're cruising. Female protagonist, let's go. I was on my way to my hometown, alone, on a express bus. Okay, she ride bus, she read. All right, Sarah's down. Unless she sees something. There were only 10 or less passengers seated here. And there. Okay. Got the heads, we got some guy with blonde hair. Oh, okay, okay. As the bus slid into a tunnel, with the surroundings becoming dark. I said surroundings, but surrounding. But hey! I let my eyes shut, closing the book I was reading on the bus to kill the boredom of a long bus ride home. Alright, so she's heading home. I've written the- I, I rode the train uh, just a, just a little bit ago, actually. I was riding the train yesterday. Was it yesterday? Like, two days ago, I was on the train. It was like a long train ride home. But it was fun. I enjoyed it. I like trains. Trains are nice and relaxing. But I can- I don't think I could fall asleep unless someone's gonna be waking me up. I was kind of by myself, and I'm not sure if someone would wake me up, so I never fall asleep on a train. On a plane, of course, because there's no stops, but... You know. It was not long before I fell asleep. I might have been pretty tired. So she fell asleep quickly, right? Some time has passed. Alright. I opened my eyes again and stared outside the window to find what we were still in the tunnel, looking all glaring red while the bus was running continuously. Okay, we got the red glow. Since it felt as if a quite a long lapse of time, I just thought that it was another tunnel, different from the one where I fell asleep. But no matter how far the bus ran, there was no end to the tunnel. It was a bus. Never mind. Guys, sorry. I'm illiterate. I must have forgot. It's not a train. It's a bus. I can fall asleep on a bus. Actually, no, they don't wake you up on the bus there. Yeah, I took the bus all the time when I worked at an airport. Yeah, they don't. They don't. They don't wake you up. They don't wake you up. I'm just saying it's not good. Don't sleep on a bus. They won't wake you up. They're mean. It seems as if an air from somewhere outside this world was surrounding me, giving me an awkward and discomfort feeling. I had chills all over my body. Okay, dude. But who's driving the bus? But who's driving the bus, guys? Who's driving the bus? I leaned over the co I leaned over to the corridor to have a better glimpse of the inside. Ooh. All the passengers seemed to be asleep, letting their bodies slip to the side. However, it did not give me a clear view due to the seats and high backs. Okay, we have some limp people. I turned around to see the tail part of the bus. Okay, okay. Oh! Okay. Okay. To find out some passengers lying on the floor with fatal damage to their bodies and bleeding heavily. All right. A feeling of terrible accident crossed my mind. Then suddenly, snap! A weird noise came from the front. Snap, snap. 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 Oh, that's not snapping. That's like chopping. Oh, dude, what is that? Dude. Okay. From then, I don't have an exact memory. I panically pushed my seat belt button to loosen myself until all my fingernails were broken into pieces, but... Clunk. Clank. 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 Okay, it's coming. What? Did this just double up? Oh, it just... Okay. This kind of... It should... Yeah, that repeated. Okay. Please! Clank. Strangely, my seatbelt did not move one bit. Oh ho ho! 
Dude, I would have a heart attack. I would have a heart attack if I saw that. Oh my goodness, dude. Oh, look at those eyes. Flump. Oh. The knife of the child went straight through my thigh, my thigh, leaving me with a burning pain and stripped my self-consciousness. I woke up to find myself in a hospital ward. There might have been a terrible accident, TV. No, there might have been a terrible accident. TV newsman went on and on, reporting this incident every day. Express bus collision in Ma Sung Tunnel. Eight were dead, including the driver, leaving only myself and the other pa another passenger alive. Sorry, I thought that's how a news person would read it. People say I was in a coma for two days with a severe damage in my leg and an injury to the head. But it was really a major accident. But they say I survived because of the seatbelt that protected me from bouncing out of the bus. I tried to convince the doctor, nurse, and even the police officer investigating the case about the kid I saw on the bus, but no one seemed to believe me. Another survivor is still in a coma. He's in the ward right next to mine. That person's probably might have seen what I saw on the bus. They're buried a family in the mountains. So, okay, sorry for my pronunciation. So, 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 see, son, located in Yog, here, see. Oh my goodness. I'm not good, guys. I'm just gonna say my pronunciation for these part is gonna be. I was gonna say Seo, Sung, located in Yonggyeongsi, in Joyonggi. It's probably gonna be. This is probably gonna be edited. I probably could even read those. Decapitated to death due to wrongful accusation as traitors by the king. Ga Ga Wang. Wang. Hey, Guang Hei. One of them was a little child who just started to say a few words. A young spirit of a child looked like half a rotten corpse and used to come down to the village and claim tens of people's lives. Having heard about the tragic story, Gong Hei, Wang, wait, Gong Hei, hold on. Wang. Guang, okay, Guang Hei, okay, I'm saying it right. Well, I placed a large rock on, on at the field where the family is buried, and the ghost of a child was never to be seen again. Masong Tunnel, where the accident took place, runs through Mount Seo, Seo, Sung, and was open for traffic in 1994. Okay, she's staring. Okay. Oh, the end. Okay. Well, that was, dude, that was really good. All right, that was another one. That was pretty good. I like that one. That was, that was awesome. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. I think it was pretty good. Um, the monster looks very scary. It was very spooky, very spooky monster designed. Um, I like the, I like how it's on a bus. I think it's really cool. Uh, it's, it's like in places where you wouldn't expect it. I wouldn't expect a ghost on a bus and like I just that'd just be terrifying if you were just on a bus and a ghost was just like, oh, and I'm like, OK, I just can't go anywhere. You're on a bus. It's like being on a train. So anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe and I'll be sure to make more content. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye.